Right. Secret passage to the bookstore is opened. And right, so we saw the dummy there. Really not much went down. We need to go solve the leprechaun's riddle. Now, I'd be lying <laughs> if I said I didn't try to look it up today. But uh, what I found was that there is a lot of different riddles that he gives. Pretty much one for each item. And out of all the ones I looked up, none of them was about the redwood or the flea or like nothing. It's like, ugh, you gotta be kidding me, right? <clears throat> Sorry, let's get this water here. My phone keeps going off. I don't even know. People know what I'm up to anyways. Okay. Another thing, they... Other people did say that his riddle resets, which it had for us, so I'm like kind of hoping, here we are, you know, next day, maybe it's different? Ugh. Because yeah, I did not find an answer for this, and I still don't know. So I'm literally gonna just like continually give him things until it's correct. Ugh. And that's just kinda how we're gonna do it. Ah, I did get a tip. I think I read something like if you use the haunted camera, take a picture, you can get a hint. And I, I don't know if that's like riddle specific, but we're gonna go ahead and try. Snap. <laughs> so I think we gotta show him the picture. <laughs> oh. <laughs> or maybe we just literally have to examine the thing. I don't know. I feel like every time I take advice, it's just like not going good so far. <laughs> Grr. Okay, dogs. Sure. It's so hard not to sing certain songs. Look at it. Polaroid photo of Crosby, the, the leprechaun. He's holding an item from the mall. Oh, ho, ho. oh there's a figure. And now run. I did miss one item. Yo, if that's it, so help me. Oh, do I got a quick save? I don't lose my progress. Cause I keep losing that photo too. I've taken photos and I've like lost them all. I had tried the blue rose from a popular TV show. <laughs> I'll try that one next, just for humor's sake. But it did say um, in the photograph that it's something he's holding in the mall, or from the mall rather. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think we did the memo. That's like, we're literally trying to. Oh. Or should we go back to that booth? See, as we found something else, like literally just backtrack for a second. There's a frig! There's a bonsai tree right there! That has to be it! Right? Giant tree to a fleet. Oh, for the love of God. Guys, we did it! <laughs> this has to be it. This is serious. Oh, wait. Firstly, not that it even matters anymore. I'm gonna have to, like, restart a game to come back for the trophies because I missed all of the photos. So we'll just do that later. Aha! Well, there now. You got it. Something I didn't expect. So congratulations, Bonsai is correct. Since you played by the rules, I should do the same. I'll leave you alone here just as quick as I came. And with a liggity split, he's out. Now we can finally explore. Yes, this is a quick save moment for sure. Oh, and I didn't lose the item, so I'm ready. What do we got? There's left or right? Because we're going right. <laughs> Shoot. So it's making me collect all these clothing items. You watch, it's gonna make me combine. Ugh. It's not even close to over, is it? The benches are perfect size for trying on shoes. Seems legit. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> Let's see. Anytime you're in a shoe store, you remember the time Chad made a scene and got kicked out. 
He decided to become the shoe monster by putting shoes all over his body. His hands, his elbows, knees, ears, head. So classic. Mom didn't think so, though. Yeah, that sounds like me. <laughs> Can't take me out. Sift through the men's shoes, looking for anything of note. You find nothing. Fitting room? Okay. You continue through the shoes, hitting fitting rooms next. Uh-oh. You're gripped with apprehension as you enter the fitting rooms. All three stalls are shut. You peek underneath each door, just in case something is lying in wait to attack. You don't see anything suspicious. But that doesn't mean you're safe. Yeah, no duh. What's behind door number one? <laughs> the door slowly opens with an extended creak. Yeah, it's a different question every time for every player. Yeah, I'd read that. You can take the receipt here. Take some jeans. Oh man, I'm waiting for this guy to like mess with me. Can I hide somewhere? Or am I gonna like walk right into him, eh? Ooh. It looks like it sparkled. Fancy. Like a left, I guess. Oh boy. Yeah, no. <laughs> Anytime I see mannequins, it's like, hell nah. I played a lot of Silent Hill. <laughs> I know what's going down. There are so many clothes in this section alone. It seems like it would take a lifetime to sell them all. You reach up to take the mannequin and immediately realize something's not right. Its torso, where you grabbed it, swivels and turns 180 degrees, loosening your grip. Oh, hell. <laughs> yeah, Silent Hill was one of my favorite series, actually. Man. Maybe we should stream that. I wonder if I can get my old stuff going. I have, I've got way too much old stuff. <laughs> can I take this mannequin, then? Okie dokie. Can I dress these ones? I'll put the dress on. You drape the dress over it, nah. <gasps> I'm being stalked. How do I get out of here? Back to the entrance? Yeah, a lot of those guys in here now. But I guess we're done there anyways. Let's go. That's like, ah! That's where I just was. Okay, then. Who do we need a mannequin for? Yeah, that looked like it was like really standing out. Oh, or as I see his shadow, we gotta get on. I think we're done. I think that's pretty much that. We got our couple things. Running for my life. Hmm. You know what though? I don't know why. I just keep thinking there might be something with the food court, but like maybe not. But I seen something over here. Quick save. Quick save moment. Probably saw something online actually when I was trying to figure out this riddle. I was like, oh, I gotta try that. So get this. Put on the mask. You pull the mask over your face. And you can use the facelifter to take it off. Out of options, you sit down in the facelifter and lean forward so the mask is pressed against the machine. Crossing your fingers, you hit the on switch and grit your teeth. Yeah, I'm sure there's like so many little things in this game that we probably didn't even come across, but... It works! You're free of the haunted mask. You spitefully shove it to the very bottom of your bag. Oh, that is a trophy. Neat. So that was a thing. I kind of just like saw it and had to try it. It's gonna kill you. I survived. Quick save. <laughs> I've got this tanning oil. I'm kind of curious if it's like it's just covered in oil now. Oops. Okay, whatever. It's an ample size empty spot on the floor. It'd be good to play. It's this. It'd be a good place to put a display of some kind. Yeah. See, they online ruined it for me because I like seen this room, <laughs> and I know that this is the thing. But. I don't know what to do now. I'm guessing I gotta dress it up. I don't know if I could put makeup on it. Is that a thing? For real? You test the lipstick on it. Yes, the surface will hold lipstick. Oh, what? Okay, let's do her makeup too. You angle the mirror in such a way that 
light reflects onto the target, which just makes it slightly brighter. Okay, that wasn't the goal, but whatever. Okay, we got this necklace. It was legit, right? It's the only one, and it fits. Look at that. Hard. That's it, eh? Just Can I, like, look at it? Jeez. Photograph of a suspected shoplifter who's wearing a nice hat, but cheap-looking jewelry. Yo. Oh, man. I can't really see that, but, like... I don't know. Kind of looks maybe like this? Maybe not? I don't know. I think she's wearing a yeah, sleeveless dress, which would be this one. Me thinks. Oh god, what is happening? She's looking like a granny. <laughs> Goodness. Hey, whatever floats your boat. <laughs> if it feels good, do it. It's kind of how I go. <laughs> What is the receipt for, anyways? Nothing anymore, I guess. What else we got? It's pretty much it. So we give her a tie. I have no idea. I don't even know if it counts for anything. But I'm dying to know if we can finally make that phone call. Oh, you know what? I bet if we dress it like the shoplifter, it would distract the security guard thinking that, you know, she's there or whatever. Seems legit, right? Oh, I forgot we left our phone here! <laughs> Typical. Okay, phone. Cell phone, take it. <clears throat> you unhook your phone and slip it back into your pocket. You feel whole again. Okay, so, I was told last night, Goulberg, so we're just gonna roll with that. Did I memorize it? Okay. Now, insert the monies. And make that call. Yeah, no, he's gonna stop me. I gotta go distract him with the mannequin. I guess it's gonna matter after all, eh? Urgh. I need to go back to Mayfield's. J, I see. I feel like we missed something. We were just kind of like running there so quickly. Make sure the mannequin looks nice and good for him, yeah. Setting him up for a hot and heavy. <laughs> Did we get everything in this store? So the women's department. I kind of like ran out of here because I got spooked. So many clothes, yada yada. <laughs> Oh, question. Oh, uh, I didn't mean to wear the mask. Man, I wanted to put it on the mannequin, actually. Oh, oh, for crying out loud. <laughs> yeah, that didn't work out so well. That's okay. Oh, maybe not so okay. Let me take a picture. I'm technically a monster, right? Can I put anything on them? Like, no situation where that outfit works. <laughs> Gripped by panic, you immediately tug at the mask, desperate to get it off your face. But the mask won't budge. It's wrapped around your head. Your vision goes red, and you feel different. Your thoughts are jumbled. Hee 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 hee. Real. Story. I, don't know, I haven't really looked in there. Again. Take a double gander. Oh, 
Pets are at the store's primary trade. Several varieties of yoga. Oh, hello! <laughs> We're looking for uh, anything we may have missed along the way so we can dress up for mannequin. Actually, I probably gotta go get this mask off. I hope it works the second time. Can we go in here? Oh, did I just walk into the guy? Yeah, I did. Grr. <laughs> Man. Oh, you gotta do me like that? He's still over there. Oh, dude. I don't think there's anything up here I missed. I can't even really look around. Decorative foliage meant to script up the mall's exterior. <laughs> it doesn't really look like it. Man, I really thought we were beating this game right now. Ah, oh, there he is. He's everywhere. At least we can go left. Get this mask off. Crossing your fingers, you hit the on switch. Poof. We're free! Yeah, I don't know. I'm looking around. I don't think we missed anything. She doesn't have the hair. I hope there's like not a wig. Or what if we were to like trick the camera? Pow, flip, jump. You acted a fight scene with the action figure. Yeah, okay, I guess not. Oh, is this the hat? You know what? I bet that's the hat. Kind of looks more frilly. Seems legit to me. Oh, you know what? I wonder. The report has details. Suspect was female, green hair, red dress, and heels. Boom. Where the hell is the green hair at, though? Like, are you for real? Maybe we were right about the hat. Yeah, the hat seems. I think it was this one. The red dress, yeah, that's legit. <laughs> I just gotta find this green hair. Like, are you serious right now? Ugh, just when you think it's over, yeah. Are you serious? I can't even go that way. I'm trying to think. Where could it be? I wonder. Took a t-shirt, but okay. Straps. Oh. Let's not get greedy. Well, who knew? Every time we come back, there's something else there. But I actually wanted to look at this to see if there's anything on the prize counter, because... I mean, I don't know. Lids, right? Can we get a purse? Since they sell wallets, it's only fair they have a selection of purses, apparently. Where are we gonna get this green her? <clears throat> you bend down and grasp the shutter's handle in both hands. Pull upward with all your might, but it doesn't move. So it's definitely locked, but you can't find a keyhole anywhere. Yet another trash can. Pet store called Little Shop of Hamsters. Alright. Really though. Looking for green anything at this point. Makeup. Woman's department. Perfume. Grr. Yeah, and I'm back to the shoes, I guess. There's this shadow. Guess we gotta back out. I'm gonna quick save before he catches up to me anyways. This way. Oh, yeah, look <laughs> at what I've done. But seriously though, where is this wig? 
Loved with the Billy Bat. In that back room. <laughs> I could never do that again. I would have to like go back to my video and rewatch what I did because I don't think I could ever actually do that again. Hmm. For real though. For real, Z's. He's really just gonna harsh my mellow. <laughs> not even giving me a chance. Seriously, not at all. Maybe he's like chasing me to where I need to be. I have something in my inventory already. I'm so tired of him chasing me. I wonder if I can like put the bonsai tree on her head. Like, do you think that's legit? <laughs> I'm like willing to try anything here. Cause for crying out loud. That's green, isn't it? So. You place the cotton candy- Oh no way! Oh no way! That legit just happened. Okay, red dress, red heels, green hair. I really hope that's the hat. Cause, jeez. Like really on the fence. Does that look like her? Yeah, it's been it. It seems legit to me. Yo, guys. Is this it? Is this it for real this time? The mall is eerily quiet when it's empty. Your footsteps echo for what seems like miles. He's still over there. Actually, it almost looks like he's taking a mirror selfie. <laughs> Look at him right here, right here. Like, is this even a clothes on? What is happening? We're getting on out of here. <laughs> Yo, quick save on that note. Like, I'm so excited right now. Like, Stop moving my legs and stuff. I'm gonna lengthy. <laughs> Finally make this call would be nice. Why didn't I use my own cell phone? What was I thinking? I could have like snuck into a closet and use my own phone. Who does that? You guys ready for this? This better work this time. I swear that was it. Yes! You dial the number you memorized and wait as it rings and rings and rings. Someone picks up. After a long silence, they speak with the o with obvious impatience. Yes? Uh, yes, this is Batman. <laughs> I'm looking for R.L. Stein. Another pause. Longer this time. Never heard of him. He's an author, you explain. He wrote the Goosebumps books everyone likes? Everyone likes them, he asks. So they're good? You find them scary? <laughs> the man on the other end of the line seems to know more about Goosebumps than he let on. They're the scariest. You lay it on thick, hoping your hunch about this number was correct. My favorite. Yo, thanks for the tip, by the way, Pedro. <laughs> oh, uh, hold on. There's rustling on the other end. Someone here wants to talk to you. This is R.L. Stein, master of horror, says an identical sounding voice. Your Batman, was it? It's definitely been R.L. Stein the entire call. That's right. Sorry, sir, but we don't have a lot of time. Slappy is here, and... Slappy? Why didn't you say so? He's serious. How'd he... How'd he get free? Never mind. Where are you? Uh, the town center Galleria? You wonder if he'll need the address. I... Okay, good. Now listen. You hear a car door open and shut on the other end. You must keep Slappy distracted. Do you understand? It's important. The car starts. Do whatever it takes to keep him busy. You can do this, Batman. <laughs> After a beat, he adds, I'll be there as soon as possible. R.L. Stein hangs up abruptly. The line goes dead. You can do it, Batman. It came from Ohio. That's it? Go back to the bookstore, right? Like, this is what's up, guys. This is it. Didn't even have to take the full hour. Oh, finally got through that riddle. Oh, I went the wrong way. I'm getting all excited here. 
I'm gonna sip in my water. <laughs> Towards Cavity City. Let's knock over my stand here. Ugh, two seconds. Let me readjust. It's about to get real. Let's readjust here. Alright. Are we ready for this? I'm so ready for this. Stealing your nerves, you press on to the bookstore and whatever waits beyond. The bookstore is bathed in darkness. There's a sense of absence that your mind races to fill. A number of Goosebumps books lie, discarded in a pile on the floor. Figure on the floor looks like a ventriloquist puppet. Hey, I guess we kind of went over this last night. Is it Slappy? No, this puppet has different hair and everything. Where is Slappy? <laughs> oh. Uh. <laughs> Didn't get me this time. <laughs> I'm so glad you could make it. What? Who are you? Do I give a name? Yeah, we're gonna be bold. My name's Batman. <laughs> I'm Batman. <laughs> I love it. Mine's Slappy. And you aren't at all who I was expecting. Play dumb. Oh, really? Who are you waiting for, exactly? A man named R.L. Stein. My papa, you might say. Nod, I guess. Yeah, I spend a lot of time waiting for my dad, too. He works a lot. Is your dad so ashamed of you that he locks you away inside of a book, never to see the outside world? Sympathize. No, nothing like that. That sounds awful. That sounds like a regular conversation. <laughs> it was. I deserve to be out here in the world. All his monsters do. So consider this our prison break. Distract him. All his monsters, hmm? How many is that, in your estimation? Well, let's think. There was Mrs. Fo Forster, the vampire poodle, Officer Murphy, the monster blood. Oh, the plant man. Can't forget him. Wait a minute. You're just trying to distract me. Deny. <laughs> what? Slabby, no. I just want to understand you. <laughs> Maybe there's a way to make everyone happy. So that's your solution? Everybody hugs it out? Sure. I don't know. Would that be so bad? A hug might do you some good. You're throwing your voice at the wrong puppet. I'm evil through and through. Jokey? Haha. <laughs> 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 well, hey there, Mr. Slappy. You say you're evil. How evil are ya? Blah, blah, blah. This has gone on long enough, and I have important things to do. It's time to say goodnight. <laughs> Slappy lunges towards you. Towards you, determined to put your lights out. Do I run or do I fight back? I feel like I could boot his ass across the room, right? You stand your ground, bringing your arms forward, ready for attack. You aren't sure how to fight an evil dummy, but what choice do you have? Just as Slabby reaches striking distance, a voice booms through the store and stops the puppet in his tracks. Not track. so fast. Not so fast, Slabby. What? But how? Batman filled me in on your little plan. It's impressive, but unfortunately not impressive enough. Oh, man. So many quotes I want to use. <laughs> no, it's too early. Nothing's ready yet. You gotta give me a redo. You've done more than enough damage for one day, Slabby. It's time to go back in the book. No, you can't do this. You created me. Why do you... Why do you that just to hide me away? Like some mistake? I'm not a mistake. My books were meant to entertain kids. That's what you monsters are for. The only mistake was letting you out into the world where you could hurt people. You'll regret this, Papa. Next time I won't be playing a game. Next time, Slappy will be the puppet master. Shut up and get in the book. Blah! He went full Mr. Bean there for a second. <laughs> Not the living dummy's night. You're Earl, Earl Stein. I forgot we were a female this whole time. The one and only. Thanks for distracting Slappy. Oh, you were listening? Had to make an entrance. Good writing's all about timing, and it's time we put these monsters away for good. 
Every story R.L. Stein types comes to life, so he keeps them locked, locked inside special manuscripts. But Slappy had gotten loose and released the rest of the monsters as well. We followed Mr. Stein around town as he trapped each monster inside the book it came from. It took most of the evening, but after he trapped the final ghoul, it was time to say goodbye. Thanks again for your help, but I must be going. My daughter and I need to reach Madison by Friday. Daughter? Madison? Like in Delaware? Madis, I said nothing. Forget everything you heard. Time to go. Hey, Mom. Sorry it's so late. Chad and I were about to head home. Oh, you bet you were. You get back here this minute. Uh, we had the craziest day. You wouldn't believe... Save it. I don't want excuses. I want to know what on earth you did to the house. I mean, honestly, Batman, I expect this kind of thing from Chad, but... <laughs> on the floor. You left the fridge open. I can't even talk about upstairs. I'm so angry. Just wait until your father gets home. We're going to have a serious talk about video game privileges. <laughs> so mom had no idea, eh? The end.